Hello, family and friends. My happy relative. Welcome into your spiritual nourishment. I am your shaman empress, aka the shaman hummingbird Capricorn. All right. So let's go ahead and get you your next 48. All right, hours. So this is something that can happen in the next 48 hours or the energy that you're going to be in with your person in the next 48 hour love reading. Okay, Cappy, these are general, so please undertake what is for you and simply leave what is not. All right, guys, um, these are also timeless messages. All of them are. So whenever you are seeing our messages, that's when you are supposed to see them. Okay, guys. That's when you're supposed to receive them. Now, the energy is fluent. It will be fluctuating back and forth between you and your person. Sun, moon, rising, Venus, and North Node energies. Sun, moon, rising at the sun. Sun, moon, rising for the third party energy, okay? Yeah, all right. <laughs> all right, Capricorn, let's get into your energy. Let's take a look at you. Let's see, okay? For Capricorn, next 48 energy coming to them or happening between them and their person messages for Capricorn messages for the collective something big is happening you're making big changes There's, or big changes is being made around you that's affecting you and this person when it comes to this connection all right what is this yeah four ones when it comes to this connection king of swords now for oh yeah now for some of you guys some of you guys could be also like moving or you're about to move capricorn or are you thinking about moving you could have to move you could have just moved yeah you could have yeah ace of pentacles some of you guys just moved or you're needing to move somebody somebody here could be also moving out all right take it how it resonates messages for the collective for capricorn all right Let's see. Let's crack this open and see what we got here. Resilience. So this person is resistant. Seven of one. They don't want to be you to block off someone here. Um, you got this person on um block. You've been blocking this person out energetically. This could have happened twice. You could have possibly had to put this person on two call blocks. This could be energetically. Or this happened twice between you and this person where you had to put your boundaries up. Yeah, Ace of Pentacles. Now, for some of you guys, you are on to a new start. This is also you, Capricorn. This is all my earthbenders here, Chisori and Capricorn and Virgo. Yeah, Ten of Pentacles. Now, for some of you guys, you're moving out. You need a new store. You're moving out of a new home. Or somebody wants you to move out. Some shit like that. Yeah, five of cups. Somebody here is miserable. Scorpion energy. It like really needs a new story. Okay, king of cups. So someone here feels emotionally drained. Someone here is also crying. Yeah. Um, someone here has been trying to get enlightenment, divine enlightenment, okay? Roosters also represent light, divine light. That's um, spiritual meaning. What is this? Yeah, okay, four of swords. Been doing a lot of reflecting. Someone here is like, I just want to rest, put this to rest, put this to bed already. Yeah, the Eight of Pentacles. Someone here has worked yourself to death trying to uh, make this work. It's like they they could have even worked yourself into like some kind of sickness. This could be, uh, so, you know, grief and sorrow manifests in stress. And stress is what manifests in diseases. What is this? Yeah, when it comes to this partnership, Two of Cups. It felt like they really tried to make this work. But it just, it's not going to work. This is not going to work. Two of Cups and the damn Eight of Pentacles. Um, now, for some of you guys, you could also just start a new job or you need to um, start a job. Yeah, the universe. I feel like things are growing worse as this energy is stagnant, as it's staying. Um, someone here is putting boundaries up. We're getting more distant here. Mm. 
-hmm. There's a lot of resistance. There's no wands here. That's where there's no action. This person is not taking no action. They're miserable. This person, to be honest with you, they want to end this. This could be you, Capricorn. Before we get any deeper, we're going to um, get your angel number. We got a uh, 5428 is your angel number. Cappy. All right. Angel number 3428 represents compassion, responsibility, inner wisdom, and strength. It is about time you unleash your dreams and goals. Somebody here is like, look, I, I, I've tried everything I could think of. Uh, uh, King of Cups, Four Swords. What I felt to do was right. Eight of Pentacles. You know, I put that work in. I put that time in. I put my money in. I'm, I've given my own resources, connections. And it's in the Five of Cups. And I'm tired of crying. I'm tired of crying alone at night. Someone here cries at night before bed. A lot. And someone here is like, look, I, I feel like I, I just want a new story. I just need something new. I just want out of this. This could be you, Capricorn, or this person. And somebody else is simply resisting this. This has been going on for a while. Uh, someone here has also tr thought, well, maybe let's, let me start putting up healthy boundaries. That ain't even work. With the universe and the four swords. That ain't even work. Yeah. Okay, let me um what's what's the resilience? Someone here, yeah, if they're resisting somebody moving on, this person here doesn't respect the boundaries that you could have set, which was healthy to try to save this. I don't somebody here is not realizing that they're sabotaging this by being resistant. I feel like if you gave had a little space or they gave a little distance or gave you a little time to reflect what you asked for, maybe it would have went different. But because this person is being resistant, it's be, it's it's like it's like they're going to make you. Somebody here is very masculine. Yeah. They're manipulative. Magic is here. The, and this is, there's no wands here. This person manipulates when it comes to their energy. Their actions. You can't trust this person. No. And what they say. They say one thing but do another. And then when you ask for your peace, you, they lie too damn much. Yeah. You, it's like, no, you lie too motherfucking much. What, what is the resilience? Death. Yeah, this is over. This is over. The, the thing is, somebody here won't let you leave. It's like they won't let you in the fucking relationship. I ain't never seen no shit like this before. It, God like, damn. Pissed off. Well, what is they do? It's like they won't let you in the relationship. They won't let you rest. They won't let you get a break. There's somebody here. They on your heels. They know you want out. Yeah, the will of fortune. They know you want to move on. It's been time. You've been trying to do this shit. They will not let you go. Ace of Cups, they have this new start, this wish fulfillment. They know you want this. You could have tried twice. Five of Swords in the damn Nine of Cups, and they figured it out. God damn. damn. Yes. Judgment. This motherfucker is crazy. They figured it out. Okay. Let me see what the magic is. Show me more on magic, please. Yeah! They are ment they mentally play games. I told you, this is someone that here that is, uh, they're very passionate with their mind games, with their actions. It doesn't match what they say. They say, well, you can't believe a motherfucking thing is saying. And it is exhausting. It is really killing somebody. Slowly. This is a slow death 
come into a relationship. Somebody here is going to, yeah, it's going to end up exploding, just going off. This is your confirmation, especially if you just saw a dead bird or some kind of feather. Show me more of this magic. This person manipulates. This is also someone that manipulates finances, money. They're emotional manipulative. And they know it hurts people and they still do it. They don't give a fuck. What's the magic? The King of Pentacles and the Eight of Swords. Now, this person plays a lot of mental games. Someone here also could have been in jail before we had some kind of money situation. I told you. Confused. This person draws confusion. This is mental, emotion. This, they, this, they're just fucking toxic. The two of swords in reverse. They have a double, someone here they do. This is someone here that, that does, it, ding, ding, that's your confirmation. Thank you, Holy Spirit. I love you so much. Um, This is someone that does deal with shame, regret, and guilt. All right, I'm here, but it, they, for, you know, giving too much confusion. But they don't care. This person, they keep doing it. They could feel like they keep having to do it because it helps them figure you out. Someone here does this to block you because they know you're leaving. They could be trying to throw you off, saying shit, lying. They know but they're not going to do this or do that. But they know that if they say this or say that, it might stop you from leaving for a little while. Yep, the six of ones. Yeah. Yeah, but the seven to one, they block you. This is crazy as hell. Um, damn, what else is going on here? Let me see, somebody here has been crying. What else is going on here? With the five of cups. Show me the five of cups. Capricorn, um, you are here, Cancerian. I think I said all the signs, Scorpion. Yeah, it's under a lot of pressure. This person is stressed and has a lot of anxiety. I told you, somebody is going to explode. It's too much grief and sorrow. They've been doing too much crying. And somebody is a not, they won't respect their boundaries. They don't care. Look at this. Drastic cut off. Somebody here, is, they want out. And they're going to explode and cut this off. This is how it's going to happen. And somebody here, retaliation and telekinesis. I told you this person plays mental games. These are mental spells, verbal spells, all kind of fucking spells. It don't matter. Mm. Yeah. And they watch. They've been watching. They, that's how they know what to say. They've been watching how you move. Yep, this person is... Someone here is like... Child, somebody here might have a mental problem. What else is going on here? That we need to know? Child! I'm fucking telling you. Homeless and loneliness. Somebody here wants to move out. Move on. Somebody here is like they're being captured energetically. Yep, collaboration is sweetheart and trap. They're trapping somebody. They got other people. This could be like, you know, help me say this, help me do this. This is a master fucking manipulator. I'm surprised the devil card didn't come out. I am surprised. The six of swords, the three of wands. The, they watch. Oh my God, this is a magician. Child. They're, it's like they're obsessed. The lovers in the three is, and there's the devil. There is a damn devil. I can't make it up. Damn. Yeah. And they take risks. The full card. The fuck. Who the job? How you meet this person? And this is someone that is hot and shit. They'll hide stuff, so you don't leave. So you don't move on. This is crazy. Uh, this person seems dangerous to me. I don't know. Because, see, when you would finally explode, somebody here can be like me. Be in a mental institution, be in jail, have a mental fucking breakdown because you're fucking, you're pushing me. And that's what I'm feeling. They feel trapped, crying, miserable. That shit will make you explode. That could be somebody's plan. 
to take something. Child, oh my God. Confinement and robbery to try to get somebody locked up. That might be somebody's plan to get the fuck away. Because they, yeah, I, I don't want to get it. Because that, that's, uh, let's see this person's feelings and emotions towards you. Child, I'm serious. Somebody here is, look at this shit. Pack your bag. Somebody here went out. One way, you can't trap people like this. Someone wants to move on, the, like, it, 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 let them go. You don't, somebody here is using all kind of mental work. This could be bills. This could be like, um, you know, things you got together. Uh, actions, their actions, doing one thing, saying one thing, doing another. They're doing all and every. It could be exhausting on both ends. What's your feelings and emotions for the collective? This person wears mini masks. They just keep switching up and shit. They don't even know what the fuck they look like no more. This is the feelings and emotions here. Shut the F up in reverse. They ain't even listening to you. For some of you guys, they could be hearing you say, you know, how you feel and things. And they're like, shut the fuck up. For some of you guys, they just ignore you. They put on a whole nother motherfucking face. It go in one ear and out another. You might not even be know as this person is looking at you, making all these face expressions. They're thinking, shut the fuck up. They don't really give a fuck. What is this? Eat your effing vegetables in reverse. Someone here um could be um eating different. If you have been dieting, yeah, you haven't been keeping up because you're you depressed. You could be depressed eating. Yep, then that's your confirmation. That project, that person, that idea is waiting. Somebody here, they know somebody wants to go. You are going through some tough shit. Yep. So they're keeping you trapped. Like I said, this could be you or this person. Oh, thank you, Holy Spirit. Um, so if you're dealing with someone from your past, all right, and you, and that you're on here for. Now, for some of you guys, this is something you can't get out of this. This can't be someone from your past. Now, for some of you guys, if you or somebody that finally got away, I feel like you're lucky. This could be confirmation that this person was doing this to you from your past. You might have thought, am I tripping? Why? Like, this person played on your psyche so bad, you could have, like, questioned your own shit. It, That's when it, you know it, a motherfucker's it, toxic. It. You just would not understand what I'm going through most days. I don't even know. I don't even understand. I'm telling you, somebody don't even... Like, they don't even know what they're thinking about the shit no more. I'm feeling emotionally void without you. Yeah, somebody here... No. I can't. I must admit that I'm longing for your touch and warm embrace. There is no good reason for the way I acted. I wish I could apologize. I feel like for some of you guys, if you are still connected with this person, even though y'all y'all ain't connected though, there's no wands. Y'all ain't having sex. Y'all really ain't. It's like, why do you want to hold on to that? It's better. I couldn't hold on to a person that and, I, and I'm only getting like 10%. Like, either you're in this shit or you're fucking not. Uh, damn it. I'm a true fire sign. I got true fire fucking placements. Like, nah. The fuck? We're not half doing none of this shit. I don't have time for all of that. That's crazy to me. What? Somebody here could even be sleeping in separate rooms. Yeah! Oh my gosh! All they do is play games. Mental games. Oh god, this is too many motherfuckers. I'm too old. I ain't play. This is not hopscotch. This is not it tag. What the fuck are you doing? What are you doing? 
You, you, this is, and, and this is someone that knows, yep, they got a wild side to them. This person knows they have played so many games with you that when they lose you, you ain't never coming back. That's another thing here. Mm-hmm. That's another thing here. Someone here could have just lost a pet or something like that. You could have just, you could have had to give a pet away. What's, what's the, um, written messages? I'm single. Here it is. <laughs> Let somebody here, it doesn't matter. You can't keep people hostage. Somebody here are crazy. Lost. Yeah, somebody here, I, they lost. They, they don't even know. Child, uh uh. Attached to my ex. Someone here is still, a, if they will not unattach from you. Because I feel like you're trying to be the ex. And it's like, they won't let you. I ain't never seen no shit like this. That you got the plan to literal escape to leave somebody. Nobody can't just say, I don't want to be with nobody no more. Like, when did we go wrong in that? Like, when did that go left? It's like you got to sue and take people to court to break up with them. When I say I don't want to be in this relationship and we're ending, we're moving on, when did that have to turn into, like, I, why do we, why is it going to that? And then when they change the address laws, that shit changed everything. Right? If you get, you know, if you get mail, somebody just can't kick you out no more. So it's, it, this shit then got, no. If somebody, no. Mm -mm. See? This is too many games for me. What is the love messages here? This person's a power hungry, crazed person. That's the best way I'm going to say it. Now, for some of you guys, this is your damn twin flame acting crazy. That's why. Now it makes sense. Because y'all twins and they don't want to lose you. Mm. You know this is a twin flame soulmate channel. So you already know. It's, you should be coming on here knowing that you're already a soul. You know your soulmate or twin flame anyway. Because um, you guys know this is card, or the card is going to reveal itself anyway. Uh, but yeah, rejoice. It's like, yay, I got you to stay, but you cry at night. Y'all sleeping in separate rooms. You don't want to have sex. You don't want to talk to them because you want to be out of this relationship. You got to have some kind of level of sickness. Like, it's, this is giving me, yep, even when I feel lost, there's always a way through the labyrinth. Somebody got somebody, like, stuck in a maze. They keep running circles around them. And somebody here, they're going to get away. You can't keep people stuck. Somebody want to leave, they're going to motherfucking leave. If you don't want to be with me, you don't want to be with me. I'd be damned if I'm going to be this miserable. And someone here don't know that it's sleeping in separate rooms. This person cries in their other room. They don't want you there. What the fuck is wrong with you? Or this other person. You guys know what I'm saying. I think this is your person. They won't leave you. It's like, I... Oh my gosh. Like, you... It's like, okay, a court... You gotta... Let's say, for example, there's a court date. Or, you know, they get mailed. You gotta wait to kick them out. Boom, boom. They'll have certain shit to... Uh, that they'll do before the court date so just in case that falls through they can't get kicked out because down they didn't create this they just keep manipulating this so they're crazy I, I if somebody here it's this obsession what's wrong with you some of you guys might need to really get the fuck away from this person i'm serious i don't care if you gotta camp at somebody's house and leave you need to make a fucking point when I'm ready to go, I'm going to go. Because this person has a power struggle issue. That could be dangerous. What's wrong with you? If I say I want space, I want space. Look at this Virgo, the house of health. This person, this is stress and anxiety. Somebody here is going to explode. And if somebody end up going to jail or somebody end up going to like a mental uh, place, somebody here is going to leave. Yep, fifth house, passion. This person has a lot of passion about you. But they got a lot of healing they got to do about their damn self. And when somebody got some kind of healing like this, don't let this cost you your sanity. That's your life. Shit, sometimes, I don't even want to say that. 
I'm trying not to. Look at this. Your men in third house communication. Mm -hmm. You could be a Virgo, a Leo, a Gemini, or a Sagittarian. Here you're connecting with or any of your four sign place, placements copy. This is crazy. Yep, Earth, Rich, in Reverse. For some of you guys, you don't even want to put your own alchemy in to heal this. Um, someone here could be underage. Someone here could be immature. Someone here could have just uh, went to a botanical shop or needs to. You need to cleanse your energy with this person. You need to cleanse your energy out of this person or away or some shit. They're, out of this. They're, in, they're infatuated in love with you. You need to get, because, you know, the botanical shop, you know, you got, you could buy salts and stuff, but they got, like, you know, little salts and herbs that is really good with cleansing energy and rebuild, re-energizing. You know, I, um, I'm a white witch, so I'm always going to talk life into my channel. Now, depending on what you do with your own alchemy and magic, it's up to you. <laughs> okay, um, but, yeah, you know, I use it for them kind of purposes, I you know. One, you, what you do with your magic is what makes the difference of light or dark magic, really. Um, what is this? Yep, yeah. I chose the karmic. Look, they're blackmailing you. They'll blackmail you, playing on your fucking phone, hiding from you and shit on purpose. For some of you guys, it's your baby's dad and baby's mom. They're hiding a secret house. They just can't even be your friend. They peeking through your window when they travel. They cheat. They could be dealing with um, tax invasions and shit like that. The ancestors are here protecting you. Capricorn, you need... I don't want to say this, but I feel like it's needed to say because I don't want to project my energy, but this is my thing. Because so we are clear here. When you are ready to move or when you say space and you need boundaries, that shit needs to be understood. And if there's somebody that can't respect that or is going to do everything in their power to stop that, then you need to do everything in your power to make sure that you're being heard, that they are listening and respecting it. Because if you don't do it, they'll never do it and it's only going to get worse and so is this misery and it's going to cause a big explosion. Somebody here could be losing their mental, having mental uh, issues. Cappy, I love you. Stay dope. We're going to shut it down right there. I'm sending you healing energy and vibes. All right. Don't forget to connect to your tarot readings. Like and subscribe and share and commenting, uplifting each other down below. Or all donations. Hit that bell and hit all. Cappy, I will see you the next time you stop by, baby. All right. You know your energy is always evolving. So stay tuned in on your spiritual messages and conversations. Stay dope, baby. Next video upload. I'll share your name, man.